Welcome back. 643 now on this Tuesday morning. How about a live look outside towards the canal right now? Mixture of sun and clouds. Clouds filling in from west to east right now. You can see more sunshine and blue skies as you look out on the horizon of Lake Superior, Superior but more clouds right overhead. Right now, 61 on top of the hill at Duluth there National. Make sure of sudden clouds as well. Winds calm up there as well. Temperatures generally kicking off today in the 50s and 60s. 57 Ironwood, 58 Hayward, 64 Ashland, 61 right now, Grand Marais, 59 Two Harbors, 63 Superior, 57 Ely, 54 Hibbing, 63 Moose Lake, 60 in Grand Rapids, and 59 right now in Big Fork. Satellite radar showing that increase in clouds as well as rain showers here as we head through the rest of the morning hours. You can see that here on Futurecast. We'll start off the day today with a little bit of sunshine out there. You could see that sunshine with that live look outside just earlier. Now as we head through the rest of the morning hours today, we're going to be talking about increasing clouds, the opportunity for a few spotty rain showers here and there, some rumbles of thunder. Then as we head through the later afternoon into the evening hours tonight, a few more pop up showers and thunderstorms. Some of those thunderstorms have the potential of being strong to severe in nature. More on that in just a moment. Then by about fireworks time, I think most of the thunderstorm activities beginning to wrap up, but still talking about the opportunity for a few spotty rain showers here and there. Those rain showers could linger into the first half of our day for the day tomorrow. Then as we head towards tomorrow afternoon and tomorrow evening, we begin to see things clear out. A good amount of sunshine for the second half of our day on Wednesday. That sunshine, that's also going to carry over into our day here on Thursday. And really Thursday and Friday look, are looking quite nice. In terms of that severe weather potential, as I mentioned, generally from the Twin Ports points north, looking at a level one out of five threat and that green color right there, level two out of five threat and from the Twin Ports points south and that yellow color encompassing all of northern Wisconsin, Gogeba County in the Upper Peninsula, as well as down the I-35 south quarter down towards the Twin Cities. That's where the best potential for severe weather is here for the day today. Now, any severe storms we do see, the biggest threats mainly would be large hail as well as high winds, possibly hail up to one inch in diameter, wind gusts upwards of 60 to 70 miles per hour possible as well. Not a complete washout here for today today. Just stay weather aware, keep your eye to the sky, download that Northern News Now weather app so you have live radar as well as watches and warnings right at the tip of your finger here through the daytime hours today. Temperatures for today today, generally staying in the 70s on the Minnesota side of things, 80s across northwest Wisconsin. While they're warmer down there, that's also going to increase their instability down there. That's why they have that level 2 out of 5 threat for severe weather. Tomorrow, though, we're all going to be cooler most places tomorrow. Temperatures generally in the 60s as well as the lower 70s. Here's looking out at that 7-day forecast. You can see the opportunity for showers and thunderstorms here for today. today. Stay weather aware and keep your eye to the sky. Temp as rain will begin to dry out as we head towards tomorrow. Thursday and Friday are looking quite nice. A good amount of sunshine overhead. Temperatures, though, cooler back into the 70s.